Hi, this is Ray Greylack, and I'm going to show you how to set up APCC to create peer flip limits that work identically on both peer sides. In this video, I am using APCC Pro version 1.7.0.25, but you could also use APCC Standard 17024 or any later version of Standard or Pro that comes out after this video. First, for this method to work, make sure you do the following. Number one, enable Meridian Tracking Limits. Two, turn off the Limit to Meridian checkbox. Three, set the Meridian Limit action to Just Warn. Four, enable both East Limits and West Limits. Next, click the Edit button to bring up the Meridian Tracking Limits Explorer. Before continuing, you may want to save your current Meridian Limits. To do so, click Save As and select or enter a new file name and click the Save button. To force both peer sides to use the east limits, the negative values in the east limits must be copied to the west side limits. You can do this by clicking More, then Copy East to West. Now that east and west limits overlap, the following behaviors will result. 1. Go to's that end up east of the meridian limit will slew to the west pier side with the telescope pointing east of the meridian with the counterweight down. To help you visualize this, I'm going to use the demo mode of the 3D telescope view. So now the telescope is pointing east, kind of weight down, pier side is west. The second behavior is go to set up between the meridian limit, but east of the meridian will slew to the east pier side, pointing east of the meridian with counterweight up. Let me demonstrate that here. So like that. And then finally, slews to the west side of the meridian will slew to the east pier side pointing west with counterweight down. So as the scope advances, it's going to point to the west. 